Very good. That Rob stuff <laughs> is amazing. So let's see what happens here. Red Rob versus Falco. Let's see how this goes. So they can BS2 as we all should. Immediately see that reflector in play. He reflects a gyro immediately. And see, now he can't really get affected by it because he's been reflected. That's a big issue with this matchup for Rob is Gyroid's kind of out of it. Uh, that being said, I really disagree with the notion of picking up items against people uh, who play item characters because you're playing against the guy who has a thousand hours of experience on this item and you've played with this item for like three hours. It's, it's not exactly in your favor. He's going to yes. know what you're going to try to do with it. Cool. So Nice, F smash. Unless you feel up. really confident, I'd advise just keep throw it out of the way. Keep on doing your combo. Or go. Okay. Oh my goodness. Yeah, immediately Gaming. Whirlpool is doing amazing. Even after that first flector, he got a crazy combo with that smash and then down air him immediately. Again, Frosty seems to counter back by just holding uh, the uh, gyroid and just... Look at uh, this pressure. Laser. Falling Nair, trying to get anything. Grabs are on deck. Up tilt is on deck. That's trying to poke things. through that shield. Falco can do that very well. You see, that shield is not really existent if you don't hit the shield. Oh my goodness. Like that. Like there. That kid. Oh, wow. That was, that was a, a little bit questionable, DI. It was questionable, but I still think that back is strong enough to kill there. Now you're seeing the up tilt combos, and this match is looking pretty even. Oh my goodness. Again, this is the reason match being good, even if. More full of that crazy down air. It does not matter. Falco's going to up tilt you. This is so explosive. I'm leaning in. This is... Yeah, we're leaning in. <laughs> it's very good overall. Good little... Lloyd. Oh. 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 There you go. Nice. See, that's that knowledge. Knowing he's going to pick a panic option good out of that gyro, air. but then the back air secures it. Nice back air. That was... Yeah. Oh, let's see if he does a Lloyd combo. Gets the up air. Whirlpool gets Oh, and the there it is. <laughs> He's okay, nice. okay. Warpool, is it? Oh, that was so fast. This guy might have touched this game before. <laughs> you think? Yeah. That was much quicker than the last few games. My goodness. Look at that. Look at this. I like the up air extension. Just, and then yeah. right up the upper with a nair. That's, that's not traditional. That's not it's textbook. Not. I didn't expect that, that was, at all. Oh, so, my. And look at this forward yeah. smash. And Trapped then gonna, between the gyro. Warpool's showing you why he knows what he's doing. So many early kills. Or... Not necessarily early. Well, that one was definitely early. That's without oh, a yeah. doubt. But just saw so kills. many kills. He just killed when he got the chance to, like every time. And you got to keep in mind when you're playing a character like Falco, you don't have kill percent. You have a kill window, right? Yeah. Once you pass that percent, then you're gonna struggle killing with a bit for a little bit longer. So you got to secure those kills as Falco. Town City, okay. Oh, my I am eating my words. He is just coming up to Lloyd, and now you look a little foolish. Oh, up air. Oh, another one. Frosty's like, yeah, you can combo me. I'm going to combo you back with my three up airs and Lloyd combo. Grabs Lloyd again. Looks like he's going to go for it again. This constant pressure, throwing out as many Ooh, moves as possible. And here we go. Trying to carry. Down Trying tilt. to carry Frosty across the stage. Let's see. Good. I like the back air attempt. Over oh, committal. Okay. It's a good back air. Let's just say that. That down air on Rob's ledge. recovering high. That's different. And it actually worked out, it looked like. Against oh. Falco, that's also very scary. Here he goes for the gyro doesn't exactly work out there. And oh my gosh, the perfect spot dodge. Barely waits out that timing and reads the air dodge. What's gonna happen off stage? What's gonna happen off? Oh, good roll <laughs> read. Good roll read. Good. Warpful did not care that he missed down air. Just went, yeah, I gotta roll him though. So up smash, and he did it. Amazing job. And Warpful does take a stock lead over Frosty. And looks, yeah, these frame traps coming out of Whirlpool where Frosty has zero good options if he commits to anything ooh, is scary. Yeah. Like, I want to mention, besides that laser that you're hit, he has not been hit by anything reflected. He's been doing a very good job of replacing his laser, replacing the gyroid, so Frosty either doesn't really get it or he doesn't get hit. And I mean, every player who plays with projectiles know the game of baiting out reflector and when to use it. Yeah. Uh, probably better than the person with the reflector themselves. That might be true. That being said, it's still... Wow, that was good later. Yeah, that was... Now, we're going to talk about Falco for a bit. Falco can't kill right now. Yeah. It sounds well, a little down weird. Down tilt and up smash are his only two options. Falco has a very linear killing option. Lin linear killing options that people are hypercognizant of. Yeah. So Falco can kill up to, I think, Rob about 140-ish. From, like, an up tilt combo or down... Now, at yeah. this point, we're going to see his up smash, down tilt, and... A that's a fair off ledge, maybe. But even then, Rob's a big man. He might not die from that even on the stage. And this you is the annoying part about playing Falco is that there's going to be so many stocks where they're just very high percent for a long time. Look, you're at 200. That could have been two stocks. Yeah. Look at 
Whirlpool, though, living this long is a very good thing, especially on this stage. Yeah. Wow. Ooh. Good laser. Didn't even, just knew he wasn't going to reflect and just did it. And now from the Halo platform for a little extra second, trying to think of something, maybe anything to crack this game wide open. If there's any character that can kill early, that is Falco. Oh, you know who else can kill early? Rob. He might be able to do this. He's looking for something. Whirlpool. That is. Mm, yeah, nice. okay. That was not JV3. Whirlpool is showing you why Mad Match ain't really that big a deal. Just doing a very solid job against Frosty. Yeah, matchups aren't everything, and I definitely think Whirlpool definitely Look had a lot boosh. of safe pressure, a lot of early kills. Use Falco's subpar disadvantage stake to his advantage. Look at all these air dodge raids out of down throw. They're really good. I mean, Whirlpool just understood the matchup, it felt like. Like, he knew exactly what he had to do and then did that thing to Frosty, which is what you have to do in this matchup when it's bad. You have to understand it to a level like this, a level where it feels like maybe Rob should win this now? I don't know, man. From what you just saw, I feel like a lot of people would say Rob wins that. But yeah, that was that was a, an insane performance coming out of Whirlpool. Just a master class in how to beat Falco. All right. Oh. The next one, we have Nelvin versus Player 4. That is Diddy Kong Peach, I believe. Diddy Kong Peach. Diddy Kong. Diddy Kong, we got banana. We're talking about items a little bit because we're